Learning About Ourselves By Eric William King, June 1, 2024 Those who are studying here at the Shepherd's Way and Nugget of Truth are beginning to grasp the depth of their Christian faith. Jesus promised that we would drink from the water that he gives us and never thirst again John 4:14. 4, this is so true. Praise God. In our Christian studies, we have learned about our human basic instincts and that the human will tries to control these instincts. Because the human will is distorted, due to the fallen human nature, it is difficult to control human behavior, our own behavior let alone another's. We deal with desires which stem from our basic survival instincts every day. These instincts are basic to our human welfare and they are God-given. The problem is that most people are trying to use self-will, instead of divine intelligence will, to control them. We could list some of these main instincts as such. One family relation, which involves the use of sex. Two material relation. Three emotional relation. Four companion, friendship relation. We must let God's will be in full control of these to make them work properly. To surrender the fallen human nature over to God goes against all human reason and logic. Humans that do not know God have allowed these basic instincts to control their lives and sometimes one or two of these instincts get way out of control and out of balance. When this happens, all bets are off. We may feel that we are being threatened to one extent or another by our environment or somebody we have become in touch with. What do we do? As a Christian one thing we do not do is try to control another person or even our environment. Changing environment may work for a short time but because we live in the fallen matrix, this fallen world, we must learn to rest in Jesus Christ no matter where we may find ourselves standing. We must begin to thoroughly understand that all problems stem from our spiritual condition. If you are not born from above you will never understand this. It is not our conditions that ultimately make us do wrong, sin, it is ourselves. We must first allow God to change ourselves, because we, by ourselves cannot change. This is a spiritual paradox in true Christianity. Those of us who are saved can testify to the truthfulness of this program. So, in ending this short article of hope, do not try and avenge yourselves, do not drown yourself in self-pity, instead begin to read your Bible and pray to divine intelligence, God. Find the Church of God and start attending. Share your time and troubles with a fellow Christian, start the healing process. My prayer for you today is to never give in or give up. Instead look up. Your redemption draw it not. By Eric William King, June 1, 2024. The Shepherd's Way and the Nugget of Truth.